Hi YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to install Newgrounds Player and fix some errors about Adobe Flash, all right? So double click the MSI, this will bring up the inst installer. Uh, remember where this location is because we're going to go there later. So each of these is a folder, we're going to go to those folders. So next, next, and then you'll want to hit yes. When it appears, sometimes it takes a minute. Or sometimes you'll see a shield icon at the bottom, so click that, it'll ask you, oop, yes or no, I'm going to hit yes, and now installation complete. So if you launch Newgrounds Player, so go hit start in the Newgrounds Player, if it shows this, then that means it's working, and if not, if it shows, hey, you need to install Flash, hit no, and then do the next steps that I'm going to show you now. So go to your file explorer, go to your C drive, go to program files x86, go to Newgrounds. Newgrounds Player, and now we have this file called install flash player 32 activex.msi. So you'll want to go ahead and copy this. I'm going to put it on my desktop. Paste, because you don't, you don't want to edit the original here. So here's this now. So what I want to go ahead and do is extract this as if it was a zip file. So 7-zip is a program that I recommend everybody go get. I assume you have it. Um, so go here, extract files, OK. And now a folder will appear. Let's open this. Now there's going to be a file called data1.cab. So we want to right click, do the same thing. 7-zip extract files. OK, now there's going to be a new folder called data1. Here's the file that we need. So this is the Flash Player installer. So what we want to go ahead and do is right click, properties, compatibility. Run this program in compatibility mode for in the drop down, you're going to see Windows XP Service Pack 3. You want to set that, hit apply, hit OK. Now, when we double click this, I'm going to go ahead, it's going to ask you yes or no, hit yes. And now, ooh, it's going to look like an old fashioned window here. So we want to check I agree and then install. And now, it's done. So now, if Newgrounds Player was not working before, now it should. 